this 2011 MacBook Air has been sitting around not being used for a few years, and recently when I went to start it, I was greeted with a screen displaying this question mark. Now this question mark screen means that the system is either not detecting a Mac operating system, or the internal physical solid state drive. Now just to be sure, I inserted a USB containing a boot volume to run diagnostics and discovered sure enough the system was not detecting the solid state drive. So to fix, I flipped it over and used a 1.2mm pentalobe driver to undo these screws around the perimeter of the rear cover. Then I used this tool to help raise the rear cover. It doesn't have to be this tool, this tool is what I had on hand. You could use your fingernails or a plastic knife, but I have to make a disclaimer here. Uh, if you break a fingernail, I take no, no liability. Now, I like this tool. It's made of plastic and it's got a wee curve on it, which is why I like to use it. But you can use anything. Before I touch anything in here, I like to disconnect the battery. That's done by simply pulling on this tab. The screw that holds the solid state card in place requires a Torx driver. Now, normally it's a T5 Torx. I didn't have one on hand, so I used this T6 Torx. And it worked okay. Um, probably not the best practice. I simply removed the screw, raised the end of the card, and slid it out. Now, I didn't show it here, but these terminals were quite dirty, so I used isopropyl alcohol to clean them, and when it was completely dry, I put everything back together. Right, so let's start it up. There we go. It works fine. 